Okay, here we are going to install BlueStack on desktop. Okay, so let's get started and um, I'm going to run you through the tutorials in this um, installation. Okay, here we have, I have two BlueStack installation here, but don't worry about this, so you will get into that in a while. Okay, so when you download the BlueStack installation file, okay, let's go use setup try to install this program okay here it says welcome to bluestack and install this program so we continue okay let's just continue it's going through and everything looks nice you know just like the excitement of Get ready to run your Android um, programs on your computer. Everything looks like it's running okay, and then you get this problem with um, error two five zero zero zero, and says BlueStack currently doesn't recognize your graphics card. It is possible that your graphics card may need to be updated. So please update them, etc. Okay, so it says update your drivers. Okay. So let's see, um, update my driver, so go to my computer, click on properties, um, device manager, okay let's see if my graphics card needs an um, updating, so we click on display adapters, so this is right there and you right click and you click on update driver software so it's search automatically online for any new updates that they will be to install them and i guess this will take care of installing bluestack okay so it's currently searching for an update for the driver software Okay, now it says that my best driver software has been already installed on this computer, so I do have the latest drivers and yet I'm getting these problems. Uh, wow. Now, so, okay, let's go now. So, we're going to close this and I'm going to show you how to install BlueStack on your computer um, by passing this problem. Okay, so we download, we have to download this um, offline installer of bluestack and i have it downloaded already so i'll post the link in the description here so i have it there it's called um bluestack hd app player pro setup which is about 150 megawatts so i'm going to go ahead and install this offline installer okay so that's the installation setup menu take it to run okay so now that is the installation wizard so we click on accept the terms and agreement license click on next okay install okay there it is um preparing for install so let's just see what happens as this continues to run At times you get these um, messages telling you to update your drivers um, for your graphics card and you go to Intel and most commonly this program is done with Intel I don't know why but you search on Intel you download you install these drivers and you follow all procedures and yet still you still get this error messages so let's just continue okay we'll start going to install my computer let's we agree to this and let's just see what happens while it is trying to install this um, offline installer of um, BlueStack on the desktop. Now, so I have a four gig, um, four gig of RAM, and I got 255, 250 gigs of hard drive. So, and 2.35 gigahertz of um, speed also. 
so my computer should be able to take it it has more than required okay so this is installing blue stack on my computer so let's just see if this could go ahead with the offline installer oh the again it says that your drivers whatever support needs to be performed graphics card etc etc oh no when you get this problem you do not click ok instead you click the x button there you click this button there and if you notice it will continue to install blue stack but if you click on OK, what you will get is it will roll back the drivers for you and it will not install BlueStack on your computer. So with this one, you don't click the OK button, but you just click on the red X and get rid of this and BlueStack will continue installing and it will bypass this um, drivers issue that you were facing. Okay, there you see it's installing the program. I do, not, I do not want to um, edit this video just so you could see everything that I went through so it may be lengthy you know doing all this but I'll just leave it so you can see exactly what I'm doing ok if you notice my blue star shortcut menu is on the desktop already and there it is also in the um, start menu also so it means that it's installed already on the computer so this is great so that means i should be able to run my applications using blue stack android applications okay let's see that blue stack agent is online already Oh, there it is. Okay, so Blue Start after for Windows Better Vision is installed and it's ready to go. So um, this is how you bypass this uh, driver's issue installing Blue Start offline installer. So thank you guys for watching and hope this works for you also.